I was always a musician, like, and my dad was uh, always a choir director, so I always grew up playing drums. Uh, everybody knows the movie Sister Act 2. So, Oh Happy Day, there was a high note that um, we were just sitting in the car, and then I just started like singing that song, and my dad was like, okay, we're singing that song. So he would just bring me, uh, bring me from the drum kit and just start to just sing that song and go back and play the drums. From then on, I kept like always kind of singing and trying to find my own voice. So that's how I kind of how I got, I guess, started. And then from there, just kept on. It was difficult because it's like, it's a grind. It's not like right away the most lucrative, but it's what I feel alive doing. I didn't, I didn't like the idea of going to work nine to five just sitting at a desk um, and knowing that I had these like God-given abilities that I felt like needed to be used. I never, I didn't necessarily get into it for the money. It was more of like, I, I just love what I do. I, I started at actually, there was a coffee shop and it was called Still City Coffee House, it's still around. I used to go to their open mics and then I did my first show there and that was actually me and my, my sister and I, we had a band together and that was our first show. I would say my musical influences, I grew up listening to a lot of James Taylor. That's my dad's like all time favorite artist. Um, and then from listening to a lot of his stuff, I kind of transitioned to listening to my, my music. My own kind of version of James Taylor became like Amos Lee. I'm like a big fan of him. Um, and then from him, just so many different other artists. But uh, those are probably my two biggest influences to my, my own music and songwriting as well. I wrote this song about last year with a friend of mine, Mario Craft, uh, called In It Together, and just talks about the idea of community and the importance of tapping into like the community that's around us, just not doing it alone. You can find a song anywhere. You can listen to music, Spotify, iTunes, Tidal, everybody, whatever you use. I decided to drive to Nashville this time around. This was the first time I, I, I took like a long drive and then had to do a show. And that like took a toll obviously on my body and my, on my voice. Usually I do rest before a show and, and have some like downtime and try to get my voice like ready. The drive down was like, it took a toll on, on me because I, I didn't really get much rest, especially when I got here to, to, to then go play the show was, was difficult. I'm learning that lesson to uh, take care of your voice. And then what helped you during the show? Honestly, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm really seriously saying this. This is the product right here. <laughs> As soon as you guys like handed it to me, I <laughs> it like five times, and I, I, I immediately felt like the, the difference in uh, just the way I was feeling. I was still kind of fatigued, out, but my voice felt like instantly kind of like just better and just like smoother. Taste was good. It, I, it wasn't like something that's like uh, like in your face. Didn't have a bad aftertaste at all either. It just kind of just was very soothing. Like I, I could taste more of the honey, I, I would say, but it was, it was definitely the soothing like effect that I really enjoyed. I'm, I'm big on routine, I like routine. And so I'm gonna figure out what's gonna work, whether what I'm gonna be using in the studio or I think I'll still be using these guys before before and after a show, um, for sure. And I love Nuka Honey, so I love that the product's made with that. I was trying to find like something to like kind of give me a boost. So I would start each of my longer sets with a haul. I don't know, I don't know how great that was for my voice. So this is like a good thing I can swap out and start doing. Uh, you can go to Instagram at Joshua Howard Music. That's uh, J O S H U A H O W A R D. Uh, the music, uh, and that's the same thing for my website and everything across the board. Thanks for coming out. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm really excited for this stuff. Like I really. Yeah. Am.